If you guys watch every week, you'll know that I have the power to bend and break forks with my mind. <laughs> So when Jennifer on Facebook said that the poutine at Fork is magical, I saw it as the perfect opportunity to try out my new trick in making a whole plate disappear. I, mean, I know where Forks come from. Really? Shut up, <laughs> please. I know where Forks come from, but why Fork? Why'd you guys pick Fork? We picked Fork just to keep it easy. We want people to say, hey, I'm going to dinner to Fork, I'm going to lunch at Fork, and just keep it with the culinary theme. So we've been in Lincoln Square for seven years now. So you got lots of regulars? Tons of regulars. It's warm, cozy, it's comforting. Great food, and the service is fantastic. We have a favorite, uh, and that's Sarah, that's our waitress. We come in and we ask what day she's working, and she serves us. That's also called stalking. Yes, it is. So we do have a lot of comfort food, I'm not gonna lie, our, our poutine, our mac and cheese. I prefer it when people don't uh -huh. lie to me. Yeah. I like that. <laughs> You mentioned the poutine, and you guys have an over-the-top poutine here, right? Our duck poutine is one of our staples. Have you had the duck poutine? So good. Like, it's one of those things that as you eat it, you're like, this is experience that it could be my last, but I, if it's not, I'll do it again. That poutine is literally one of my favorite things to eat in the city of Chicago, and that's saying a lot. All right, Larry, you are the master of the poutine. What we'll do first is uh, cure the duck legs. Comfort food to me is rich and there has to be an element of fat. We cook it at uh, 300 degrees for about 12 hours. That's perfect because that's just enough time to maybe go and check out the wine cellar. Now I just need to soak up that fermented juice. Got it. Duck fat, seasoning, stir. Duck neck, seasoning, stir. Reduce duck stalk, seasoning, stir. Holy <laughs> That was a lot of steps. Duck's cooking, our duck gravy's done. Yep. This is a process. I was not prepared for this. What's next? We're doing a cheese sauce instead of cheese curds. Lots and lots of cheese. Oh my God, my arm is gonna fall off. Someone needs to contact HR. The next step, we're gonna cut some fries. Now we get to building. Exactly. Another one, yeah! Now this one still hurts. You know, we discussed the cheese curd thing, which you swap for cheese yeah. sauce, yeah. and then we'd be gravy. Normally, both those things would be on top. However, we have two little beautiful jugs here. Do we just pour and enjoy? Is there a particular order? As you, as you like it. Clink it. Cheers. It's like an internal hug. It is rich as hell. It is satisfying. It is everything that you can imagine. So I think we take a classic and make it our own. It's comfort food. Cheers to poutine, to comfort food, to burns. <laughs> <laughs>